Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy. Now, for today's video, we're actually going to be going to a dealership that they invited us over. They have crazy supercars and maybe hypercars, if I'm not mistaken. But we're not only going to be taking my GTR. We're actually going to be meeting up with the homie with the R32 Kevin, the one who came in clutch during that prom video. And we're going to see what kind of cars we can find over there at the dealership because they did show us pictures. And, bro, the cars that are there... <laughs> beautiful ladies and gentlemen beautiful so it's gonna be really dope getting to see these in person pretty sure the freaking whole dealership is worth like over 10 million 100 percent, bro like the cars that are there bro just 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 wait until we get there just wait until we get there <laughs> actually change of plans he's gonna actually meet me up at this chevron right here because my freaking tire bro it keeps on getting flat i think i did hit a nail or something bro because it's like the fifth fucking time that i've been filling up this freaking tire so i need to probably swap that one out or maybe just swap out all the tires completely bro i mean this GTR is running my pockets, bro. I'm gonna do a whole new look, grab wheels. Now this, god damn it, bro. Fuck my life. This fucking, this guy's not even moving. What, what are we doing? They don't want to let you in, bro. <laughs> Jeez, we got Kev finally pulling up. And guys, now we have to meet up. Oh, verga. <laughs> we met up with this homie right here with this G35. Yeah, so that's everyone already, guys. We're gonna head out in just a few minutes right now. Yo, guys, I'm literally following the maps where it's telling me to go. And look, we have a freaking GTR right here. What the heck? We have another GTR right here. That's sick. <laughs> All right, guys. We just pulled up right now, and Kevin over here is having some technical difficulties. What happened, bro? That's why you got to get an airlift suspension, bro. Ah, ha, ha. Rich people use zip ties. Huh? Only rich people use zip ties. Bro. Hey, that's facts, bro. <laughs> <laughs> literally zip ties and you're goaded bro but this is a spot right here guys it's called iluso leader and hypercar inventory so you already know what that means guys we're gonna see some freaking hypercars and right off the bat right here there's an r8 outside i'm guessing that's the owner right there all right guys we just walked in right here look at this pagani right here though this thing is crazy bro all i, all I see right here is just money bro money oh my days bro imagine working here dude let's have a business meeting guys Oh my god, bro, look at this. <laughs> uh, take two, take two. Oh, wow, I wasn't expecting you. Welcome to my crib. Sheeeeee. <laughs> This is nuts. Look at the cars that are here, bro. There's a freaking Carrera GT, bro. Bro, that's insane. That's actually insane, bro. This was Paul Walker's favorite car of all time, bro. Damn, there's a freaking 4 GT. This Mercedes, bro. Like I said, I don't have that much knowledge on like hypercars and supercars and stuff like that, but I just know that this one right here is roughly like five to six hundred k, bro. This is nuts. Look, see right there. That's the price tag right there. Four hundred and thirty-nine thousand. So I was kind of correct oh my god so this is a dealership guys you guys literally could buy one of these cars if you guys were to pull out bro but there's still way more cars over there in the back dude all right guys so there's a price like not enough you can't cheat what you can't cheat how much do you think the career gt is worth how much do you think it's worth bro i would just estimate 1.2 1.2 you one i want to say like 950 somewhere around there i don't i like i myself i don't really know that much either guys but uh does it say <laughs> oh, i was way off I was way off, bro. I just disrespected a Carrera GT like that. He was actually the closest one. He said 1.2. I'm like, nah, maybe like 950, bro. It's 1.6. You shitting me? And it sticks. Bro, I don't even want to be this close to it, bro. I'm kind of scared right now, bro. One little scratch or something, bro. I'm done, bro. The GTR gone. My house is gone, bro. My left nut and right nut is gone. <laughs> I'm going bankrupt, bro. That's insane. I didn't know that these were worth 1.6 million. Bro, that's insane. And then right over here, guys, we have this beautiful STO, this satin black Huracan. But we have this GT3 R, I believe this is the RS, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, the GT3 RS, bro. Oh, that, I guess they're not selling this car, bro. This is literally one of my favorite cars, too, dude. Oh, my God. One day, bro. One day, I hope I can get a GT3 RS, bro. Like, I never really liked them before, but the more I saw them and then seeing my homies, bro, I just freaking want one now, bro. This thing is a beautiful machine right here. 
huge shout out to Hunter, bro. Like I haven't met Hunter guys, but huge shout out to him for letting us even be able to come over here and see all these beautiful cars, bro. And shout out to Iluso, bro. The hospitality here was amazing, bro. They let us right in, dude. It's just like, like ah, this is insane, bro. I have never seen a freaking warehouse like this with a bunch of freaking supercars and hypercars, bro. Like this whole lot, bro, has to be worth, I, my first estimate was like 10 million, no. After seeing that Courage GT worth 1.6 million, ain't no way this is worth 10 million, but this is worth, this is way over 10 million right here, guys. Jesus Christ. Guys, I didn't even notice this SL65 right here. Look at this, V12 by Turbo, bro. I have never, ever seen one in my entire life. This is literally my first time seeing one of these, bro. This thing is crazy, bro. I'm pretty sure these are really rare, bro, because like I said, I've never seen one in my life. This thing comes wide and body, bro. Look at this. This thing is thick, bro. This shit got a BBL, man. I wish they can start her up, bro. I wish they can start her up. I'm pretty sure this thing sounds amazing. Yo, they have Stratoman 6x6 over here or what? Sheesh, damn. This is my first time also seeing a 6x6, bro. This thing is sick, man. God damn. Imagine going off-roading in this thing. This thing's a beauty, bro. The only one I've ever seen was freaking Stratoman's. Never one like this, bro. This thing is sick. And look right here, you guys. They have a freaking mint as NSX right here, bro. This thing is beautiful. Look at the interior. How freaking good the condition is. I don't think this one has a price tag. This one is freaking mint condition. Jesus Christ. Bro, they have a freaking demon over here. Look at this. Holy moly, bro. That's when you know it's a demon. Look at that. These things are pushing. What? These things are like a thousand horsepower stock, huh? Or 800? 809? That's still crazy, bro. Freaking stock 809 around there, bro. Horsepower. That's insane. Look at this beautiful RS6 right here, guys. I've said multiple times in videos, and every time I see one of these, bro, if I were to have a family car, bro, if I had to get rid of the GTR, okay? And I have to get a family car, this is it right here, bro. Ain't no way I'm, I wouldn't get one of these, but look at this. Saturn Black 2 with black wheels all blacked out, stealthy. If I have a kid, I have to get rid of the car, bro. This is the family car right here. Ain't no way I'm not getting one of these, bro. <laughs> this would dead as be the family car, bro. I've, I swear to you, bro. This thing is a beauty, bro. And right here, look, we have a freaking Cullinan, and we have this BMW XIM. I've actually never really seen this. This one has to be a new one. And then the Urus. Which one would you guys choose, guys, from these three right here? These three big bodies right here. Which one would you choose? The Cullinan, the BMW, or the Urus, bro? Honestly, I'd probably take... Uh, uh, I'd probably take the Cullinan, to be honest. The Cullinan, bro, is just a different freaking level, bro. And inside, bro, it's just luxury bro luxury bro and then the freaking stars on the roof and then the freaking seats and everything i mean obviously we can't go inside there but i've seen videos on these it's just a beautiful beautiful masterpiece guys i didn't even know that we can get up over here bro i didn't know there was a top view look at this wow bro motivational bro for real how much do you guys think the whole lot is worth over 10 million for sure over 20. give an exact number you're, you're underestimating so far i think it's worth more than my life <laughs> 43 million. 43? You? I say like 50. 50 mil? You? I say 98 million. 98? He's going up to 100. 100? All right, he's 100. I'm guess like 120, 120, 120 million. Boss, by any chance, do you know how much the whole entire lot is worth here? I don't know. If you can give a good guess. I said 120. He said, how much? 98. 98. He said 100. 100. I said 100, but I changed it to 50. He said 50, and then you said like, what? 43. 43. I don't know. I think you guys, I think it's probably in that 100 range. 100 range? Yeah. Damn. More, it depends on the day. Oh, okay. We okay, get okay. a few Paganis in here. And, oh, no way. You guys get Paganis in here too? Inventory constantly changes. Damn. Always something different that comes through. And then um, the 200 mile car in silver that just sold on BAT. How much is that one sell for? Two million. Two million. That's on our Miami right. site. Put up thighs if they were selling for 350 back then, they were 350, 380. Yeah, yeah. and then now whoever held on to them at the I, time, yeah. they made some good money yeah. off that. Guys have dropped me up, we've got 9,000 miles. That's yeah. nothing. You know, we'll, That's we'll see if it brings 1.6. But... Guys, I was literally just telling them that my favorite car is the GT3 RS. And this is literally the spec that I would want it like that, bro. In silver with bronze wheels. Oh my god, that thing is a freaking beauty, dude. But they're bringing in an Aventador in right now. That freaking RS. Oh, with the lights on. Ugh. Guys, I'm in love, bro. I can't stop looking at this one right here, bro. How funny. I was telling him that the RS is my favorite. And literally, this one shows up. Oh, 
dude oh my god i'm fangirling to the max right now bro look at this man one day bro one day man someone buy my gt already bro just someone buy it already god damn it all righty guys we're heading out right now shout out to i lose 100 for letting us stop by bro the cars that they have there is just freaking amazing man like you guys they're gonna be actually throwing more shows and event stuff here soon so definitely pull up over here guys that's the name i lose leader in hypercar inventory bro he was literally telling us that they'd be getting in pagani's too bro if you guys don't know i freaking love I freaking love Pagani's, bro. So definitely, hopefully, once they have some in stock right here, bro, I'm definitely gonna be pulling up. But, but right now, we're gonna go ahead and get some grub because I'm freaking starving, bro. I haven't had food since last night, so we about to see what we at. What we at? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>